What's up, peeps? John Williams here at the distance. Got a video for you guys. This is a post fight video to Tavoris Cloud versus Gabriel Campillo. Now, I uploaded this video earlier and you were not able to hear any sound from the video, so I decided to re upload it. So, and it's a good thing that you were not able to hear the first video because somebody here fell asleep during the fight and was snoring in the video. So, I apologize for that inconvenience. And now, the same person who was snoring in that video is laughing. And they should not be laughing because it's not um, appropriate to be snoring. If you do snore, then you need, do need to get it checked out. And no, I have not been drinking. So anyway, let's talk about this fight. Tavoris Cloud versus Gabriel Campillo. First off, I had Gabriel Campillo winning. Second off, Tavoris Cloud was exposed. And third off, I just feel like saying I just feel like saying this again. Tavoris Cloud got his ass exposed. Now, first off, in the fight, you know, in the first in the first round. You could tell that Tavoris Cloud was looking for one big shot, um, and it was the right hand. Um, pretty much like he was looking for the right hand from out of, from you know a specific range, and he you know he was able to land it you know and kind of caught um and caught Campillo flush with that right hand directly right on the jaw, and you know and um in that first round you know he got you know two extra points. Now if it wasn't for that for that knockdown in the first round, then Campillo would have won the fight. Um, but, but um, Tavoris Cloud just did a good job in that first round, just cutting off the ring, kind of cutting his corners and hitting him with that right hand and setting him up for it um, in that in the in the early rounds. But from then on, you know, Campillo made the fight very awkward for him. He he moved clockwise and counterclockwise, hit him with the left hand uppercut, and kind of set him up. Had had Cloud backing up in this one, and you know, just fighting from the outside, making. Making Cloud jump, you know, lunge in, and come straight forward and pull straight back, and Campillo just did a good job of just, it just um, of him utilizing, you know, just his his left hand, his movement, and setting up and creating shots using his angles and using, you know, and using the ring, and it was a smaller ring, but even with it being a smaller ring, you know, Campillo was still able to find his shots and find his rhythm after that second round. He made little adjustments. And you know he moved away from he moved away from the left hook, and um and kind of moved away and angled away from the from the right hand, and and just made this fight very awkward for for Cloud to where Cloud was not making any adjustments at all in this one, and not only was he not making adjustments but just overall Cloud just looked confused in this fight. It just looked like it was not his his kind of fight. You know Cloud was um you know he continued to turn. And Campillo just hit, continued to hit him with a jab from specific angles, specific directions of the ring, to where he just didn't see coming, and he wasn't defending himself from these shots. He was just kind of just standing there, and he was just taking the punches, taking the blows, and you know, and just continued doing the same thing, coming in a straight line, pulling straight back, and you know, leading in with hooks. And Campillo did a good job of shortening up his punches, but also using his reach to his advantage, to where he would land first. And not only would he land first, but sometimes he would end exchanges or in spurts would just throw throw um numerous combinations throughout the fight. So overall I did have Campillo win in the fight. It was a scorecard robbery, and if you ask me. And I can understand in a way why some judges were scoring for it towards Cloud because he would have his moments to where, you know, he's in there, he's throwing, you know, you know, about fifty, sixty punches in the round. And, you know, he's just walking straight forward and kind of trying to, looking like he's walking him down. And a lot of those punches weren't even landing clean, but it it looked effective to, it probably looked effective to judges. So, anyway, it was robbery. Campillo deserved the victory. So, anyway, no intro, no outro. I got these videos up. Gotta go home. So, anyway, peeps, that was Distance. Thanks for watching. And appreciate your view. Whatever. Peace.